Hello, and welcome to a video tutorial of the TradeZero Pro platform. In this video, we're going to cover some of the basic setups on the chart, some of the indicators that traders use, and we're going to make this really simple. So there's a lot of features and a lot of indicators that traders can select from. So what we're going to do is right click on the chart area, go to indicators, and here in this column we have a list of different indicators here and we're just going to go ahead and add the moving average and what I like to do is just add the simple moving average we're going to go ahead and select 20 change the color here you can change it to any color that you desire we're going to select the next one make this 100 and then the last one, make this a 200. Okay, also just going to go ahead and add VWAP and then also volume. Now for VWAP, I'd like to change the color to white. And one of the other indicators that are frequently used by traders are, is the relative strength index. This is a good indicator to use. I want to show you something here. We have the period for 14 so I'm going to add the 14 period here for the RSI and you can see that it's very um, smoothed out we'll go back into our indicator list here right click go to indicators now RSI if you would like it to be have some more peaks and valleys in the subgraph and you can see here we changed it to a lower value and on the RSI we have 70 indicating overbought 30 here is indicating oversold. One last thing that I would like to point out is that if you would like to unselect the pre-market or after market data, right click, we're going to go to symbol and format, and select filter after hour. So we have this check mark and then that's going to remove the pre-market aftermarket data. Also, if we want to change the inter interval, the chart interval, to something that is not listed here, we have one minute, three minute, but we don't have a two minute. All you have to do is just change this value here. And your chart becomes a two minute chart. You can also do the same thing for the 10 minute interval. Also, I want to mention that when you create your layout for your chart and you add your indicators, you can only do it to this chart. There's not currently there isn't a feature to save your layout and then create another chart. You're going to have to create each chart individually. Also, if you would like to make your chart even look nicer, you could remove the X and Y grid lines. And it starts looking like a very professional chart. So that's it. So now that we have our charts configured, we're one step closer to becoming a professional trader. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Stay tuned for more videos on how to use the TradeZero Pro professional trading platform.